Hey everybody, I'm Integrative Life Mentor and Health Coach Kimberly Liu and today we're going to be talking about the inner child. So a lot of times people say to me, you know, Kim, what's the difference between the inner child and the ego? And I always say, um, the ego is something that protects that inner child, right? That child is the wounded part of us and that ego is put in place by telling stories like I'm not in the world is that creates stories to protect the child. And even though the stories may not be true, they are there to put in place to make sure that there is some kind of survival skill. But what happens is, is after years and years and years and layers and layers of stories, what we start to see is, is basically not the truth. So then people come up to me and they say, I'm, I want to unravel all of this, but I'm afraid of who I am. I don't know who I am without all these stories. Who, what am I going to find? And usually what you're going to find 100% of the time, not usually, just 100% of the time, is that child, is that wounded child. And that's why it's so terrifying to be able to take off all those stories because now you're left with you, a, a, an innocent, beautiful, perfect version of yourself. So then that being said, what can we put in place of those stories to make sure that we can protect ourselves? And the answer is, ding, 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 boundaries. So boundaries are now going to be put in place instead of the stories so that child can learn how to develop the skills that it needed, the tools that it needs in order to continue to, to live and grow. And eventually, once that child feels safe within those boundaries, then it can grow up and be one with you. Now, I'm Kimberly Liu. If this video helped you out in any way, smash that like button and subscribe. And remember, you don't have to do this alone. We're going to shift from settle and survive to accelerate and thrive and into a life you love together.